Okay, so I had a problem with my Smoke TFV4 where it constantly read check atomizer no matter what mod I put it on. It would not detect my atomizer. Thought something was wrong, did a bunch of research. Make a long story short, let me show you how to fix that, okay? There's a fix for it. Your mod's probably okay. I've seen rewiring your positive posts to all kinds of crap, turning your battery inside out, all kinds of ridiculous. What it ended up being for me was a simple connection problem inside the bottom of the tank of the TFV4. I'll show you where that was and what to do about it. So down there in the bottom, the bottom of the base, you see that pin? You can press that pin down with some needle nose pliers. Look at the bottom of this. See that tip right there? It'll come out. I'll show you what it looks like when you've pushed it through. I'm going to use these needle nose pliers and just push straight into the bottom of that. Nothing big, no rocket science. So here it is. After I've pushed it through, you see that pin sticking out now, the tip of that right there? Exactly the way it looks. You can depress that. It'll go right back in. Watch this. See? Just pressed it right back in. And it's back up in here. So I'm going to press it out again. Actually, I, yeah, I was going to say I can use my pinky. No, I can't. I've got to use those needle nose, so I'm going to press it back out. And then the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to stick my atomizer onto this, not onto the top part. I normally would say put it on the top part first, but not if you're the bottom of your tank, your TFV4 is reading bad atomizer. Okay, so I hope that was helpful in helping you solve your problem with your TFV4. Don't make the mistake that I did. Um, I went ahead and ordered a second one. I'm just going to sell it to my son or my friend or somebody because I don't need a second one. Or actually, I might sell them my used one and keep the brand new one. Either way, don't order a new one. Try this fix that I showed you and see if that works. Whenever you get your uh, atomizer screwed in there and you get your tank all back together, screw it down really, really, really um, slow and secure to the bottom, to the mod. Um, don't try to go overly tight or underly loose. And if it makes the connection, you'll see that, you know, the atomizer readings, 0 0.16, 0 0.18, 0 0.21, whatever it is. And then you'll know that your atomizer is good. So it's not your tank. You do need to make that pin adjustment. Hopefully that'll do the trick for you. Like, share, subscribe. Thanks. Have a good one.